The U.S. Postal Inspection Service has a long and rich history as one of America's oldest federal law enforcement agencies. After two centuries of combating crime through the mails, postal inspectors remain at the cutting edge of criminal investigators. In fact, we enjoy the highest conviction rate of any federal agency. Still, the best way to beat crime is to prevent it. Here are some simple steps that will help make sure you don't fall victim to these scams through the mail, on the telephone, or by internet. If an offer seems too good to be true, it probably is. Use your good common sense before you part with your hard-earned cash. Number two, do your homework. Before investing any money, purchasing an expensive item, playing the lottery or sweepstakes, or even replying to an email, do some research. Contact your state attorney general's office, the Federal Trade Commission, or consumer protection agencies to verify the offer. Number three, pay close attention to the financial dealings of relatives who may be sick or aged. Often these con men will target the elderly, seeking to prey on their unfamiliarity with new technology or recent loss of a spouse. Provide support for your relatives, offer to help them with email or website purchases, and make sure they're aware of the potential danger of fraud. You can also take preventative steps like encouraging them to sign up for the Federal Trade Commission's Do Not Call list to help them avoid telemarketing fraud. You can also learn more about the various types of fraud by visiting our website, www.usps.com slash postal inspectors. Our website often contains information about new types of scams and ways that consumers can avoid becoming victims. For over 200 years, we've helped to keep the mail safe. The Postal Service delivers the mail, but postal inspectors deliver justice. And you can count on all of us to make those deliveries.